Hello everyone, this is Mujex, also known as the Cynical Gamer, and welcome to another World of Warcraft Vanilla Guide. Today we'll be talking about tailoring. Now this guide will show you how to get your tailoring from 0 to 300 as quickly as humanly possible, uh, and will only use recipes available at the trainer until 275 skill, at which point you will be using a standalone recipe. This guide does not tell you how to get uh, all different recipes from quests, vendors or drops. What you do once you hit 300 is entirely up to you. Alrighty then, so for the 1 to 50 skill bracket you will be crafting Bolt of Linen Cloth. For the 50 to 70 skill bracket you will be crafting Linen Bags. For the 70 to 75 skill bracket you will be crafting Reinforced Linen Cape. For the 75 to 105, you will be crafting bolts of wool and cloth. For the 105 to 110 skill bracket, you will be crafting gray wool and shirt. For the 110 to 125 skill bracket, you will be crafting double stitch wool and shoulders. For the 125 to 145 skill bracket, you will be crafting bolts of silk cloth. For the 145 to 160 skill bracket, you will be crafting azure silk hood. For the 160 to 170 skill bracket, you will be crafting silk headband. For the 170 to 175 skill bracket, you will be crafting formal white shirt. For the 175 to 185 skill bracket, you will be crafting bolts of mage weave cloth. For the 185 to 200 skill bracket, you will be crafting crimson silk vest. For the 200 to 215 skill bracket, you will be crafting crimson silk pantaloons. Why the hell they don't just call them pants, I will never understand. For the 215 to 220 skill bracket, you will be crafting black mage weave leggings or black mage weave vest, whichever you prefer. For the 220 to 230 skill bracket, you will be crafting black mage weave gloves. For the 230 to 250 skill bracket, you will be crafting black mage reef headband or black mage reef shoulders again depending on your preference for the 250 to 260 skill bracket you will be crafting bolts of rune cloth for the 260 to 275 skill bracket you will be crafting rune cloth belt alrighty then so as i've said at the beginning from 275 upwards you will be crafting a third party recipe which you get from Kia Kiwia or however you uh, pronounce her name she's a female goblin in Everlook Winterspring and the recipe you're looking for is rune cloth bag so from 275 to 300 you'll be crafting 25 rune cloth bags all right so before I close out this guide here is a rough estimate of all the materials you will need to get from uh, 0 to 300 tailoring Linen cloth about 160 that's 8 stacks, wool cloth about 200 10 stacks, silk cloth this is a big 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 one about 760 that's 38 stacks, another big one mage reef cloth about 520 that's 26 stacks, room cloth another big one about 900 that's 45 stacks and rugged leather about 60 that's 3 stacks. Alrighty then, so if you followed every single step, you are now at 300 tailoring, congratulations. Uh, a few closing thoughts, tailoring works excellent with uh, enchanting, because of course you can disenchant every single uh, green or blue item that you craft instead of just uh, vendoring them. And like I said at the beginning, once you hit uh, 300, what you do is completely up to you. My personal favorite, of course, if you are on the appropriate server, is to craft the Bloodvine set once you uh, sort out your uh, Zandaleri tribe recipe as they do sell for a really good amount of gold. So with that said, uh, thank you for watching this guide. I really hope uh, it helped you if you were considering leveling your uh, tailoring. If it did help, please consider leaving a like and also subscribe to my channel. It really helps me out. And stay tuned for the next uh, vanilla guide which will be enchanting. And I will see you next time.